today in Teardown Therapy we have portable DVD player okay hello guys today I will tear down portable DVD player as a child I always wanted to have something like this and now I have it but it's not working there is some power LED is working but there is nothing happening uh, so let's tear it down in every corner there is some easily easy to find screws uh, there is only one hidden screw under the sticker of manufacturer so if you are tearing down something like this you should know that uh, in this device we have uh, connection with USB, uh, SD card, TV antenna, uh, coax and audio video out so e when you open it there is a lot of uh, small flat cables or power cables like you can see these small cables are for push buttons uh, bigger ones are for DC motors for DVD drive and bigger flat cable is data cable from when you are reading discs uh, it's very easy to open it just uh, be careful if you are repairing it do it slowly uh, and every flat cable uh, like on laptops and other devices have uh, little tabs you need to just push the tabs like you can see on video and plate cables go out goes out very easily if it's not really going very easily you didn't open it so I was very interesting interested uh, what uh, is underneath of uh, this uh, main board or motherboard of this device uh, so if you remove few screws it is very easy to open it and underneath uh, this underneath this motherboard you can find lipo battery I was, I was very surprised to see lipo battery also in, on this device and when I tear it down tear it down uh, I measure 5 volts it was very unusual to see 5 volts uh, I thought the battery is unstable or something so I did um, unsoldered uh, wires and there is two cells in this battery there is like two batteries glued together uh, there uh, that is the purpose of that white wire it is between two cells so when you charge it you need you charge uh, each cell differently so the biggest find of this device was this cell it is little bit low on the low side but it is okay for small do-it-yourself projects um, upper half of half of plastic uh, there are there is a DVD mechanism with two small DC motors and some mechanism mechanism gears mechanism mechanism and gears so I don't know what's what's about with DC motors but if I see one I keep it for I don't know something uh, upper half also has a PCB board you can see it on the top left part green PCB board with push buttons and two speakers each is uh, 16 ohms uh, display is very fairly easy to open you have few screws uh, under uh, rubber plugs and plastic uh, buckles like every screen under bezel uh, you can see all the parts in video 
uh, what you can get if you uh, disassemble one for spare parts or if you need some parts for project like uh, small components a uh, screen for our uh, Arduino or I don't know Raspberry Pi with PCB board power PCB board flat cable which is very vulnerable on this device and uh, usually this is the first thing that goes on them and of course small speakers uh, if you make uh, small Bluetooth or um, something like that um, do-it-yourself project and of course DVD mechanism like in every CD DVD ROM it was very fun to open something like this I hope you enjoyed goodbye